1979. And immediately a big hit on Sandon McCoy again. Trying to get an option pitch and he can't. He's dropped for a loss again and it's Pittman who Gary just talked about. At the line of scrimmage. And the Army's going to throw. No, they're not. Sack. Jackson Perkins and Jacob Springer are there. Army kind of showing blitz. They'll back out of it and it's the fullback and he's not going to get there. Carruthers hammered by Eric Smith. Holy mackerel is some hit and go on. Not in Navy games in the past. Get six. That's the analytics of it all. Second and eight. No pitch for Anderson, but a wide open field. Great run out to the 45 for Christian Anderson. Got a little bit closer to his quarterback, and he'll be the shove man. Did he get it? I think he did. The last one on the quarterback sneak here. He's got the pitch to Kel Walker, and he is dropped for a loss. Five Army Navy games, and of all the games he worked, this was the most cherished game of all for sure. It is for a lot of people and a lot of us in this business as well. Sandy McCoy, the fullback. They will not toss it, and Anderson's got another first down. But on this drive, they have been. Is Anderson going to pitch? Nope. He's going to keep, and he's close. Yes. The two backups are in there in the offensive line already. McCoy has got the first down at the 10. Anderson on a counter, trying to keep it, trying to get to the edge, and he is in! Touchdown, Army! Watch them pull around, and then it's the counter and the great patience by the quarterback to set up the block, and the block by Herndon is a decleater. The best you can do. And to Notre Dame in mid-November. He thought about a throw. <laughs> what a move. He might still throw it. And he's not going to. He's going to actually lose a yard. On a second down and 11 to open the second quarter. And he'll keep it. And Malcolm Perry does what Malcolm Perry does. And it's Perry behind Carruthers. First down, side set. Inside the 40. He might take it. Malcolm Perry. Navy. Touchdown. This guy's too quick. Coach Kenny says, no, oh, reach out. The best runner Navy's ever had. He went right through Elijah Riley, number 23. He had a shot. And that's Army, third down at three. Perry reverses his field. And somehow found enough room, I think, for the first time. He's got it with forward progress. Quarterback will go down for a loss. It'll be fourth down and eight. Third and two. Carruthers, first down. Perry keeps it, got the first down, out to the 39. Here's a pass up coming. Perry all day to throw, I forget about it, it's not a pass, it's a run, and he's still running. And Malcolm Perry with a blocker out in front, down the sideline, finally bumped out of bounds. A third and five, Perry, and he's going to try to get to the corner, he did, he got the first down. First and goal. This is Malcolm Perry now an end around to Chance Warren. He'll throw it. And Carruthers got it. Touchdown. Here's Warren. Here's the TD receiver right there. Pitch it out. Sneak the fullback out. Army sees it a little late, and it's a perfect throw. Carruthers got a big opening. Blasts his way for about nine. Barry is going to keep it this time, follows his blockers, spins his way for about 11. How about that run? And a first down. And he'll keep it again, and he's got the edge. If he gets the corner, he might be gone. Perry will be pushed out of bounds, but not before he's got another big gainer. And now behind the Navy kicker, and it's blocked. Army comes up with a big special teams play. It's Elijah Riley. Yes, we can. Watch the speed of four-year starter. Big Michigan game, but piece of the block, and that allowed him to get through it. Look at that coming off the edge. Guy with the ball. This time it's Carruthers. The fullback. And Carruthers breaking tackles down to the 25. You look across the line at Perry. Don't yell pass. And he's not going to. Here goes Malcolm Perry. Not only a first down, but all the way to the six yard line. Rides away from another touchdown. Carruthers straight up the gut. Six more right there for the midshipman. 
Watch, everybody just go straight out. Just get the guy in front of you. Good block that time from the right side. Honaker, number 71. Yes. He was a fun guy to talk to the other day, Jackson. That's up. Balls out. And swarmed under a loss on the play. Brandon Walters, and he's lucky he didn't lose it. Isaiah Cromartie was right there. And it's lucky that Army still has the football. You get tackled late like that. Watch, ball comes up, drops it, gets it. Has it, and he's very fortunate he didn't cough it up. But they really haven't had to because of what he can do like this. And there goes Malcolm Perry again. Perry taking would be tacklers with him. The tackle for the Pittsburgh Steelers. Has another first down run, and now he has topped what he did a couple of years ago as far as rushing yardage. This one's up, and just tucked it inside the right upright. Anderson will try to do it himself, and he does. Oh, then he pays the price for it. Anderson, no late pitch here. He's going to be quick drop, quick throw. That one is caught. And they get it. Guess who? And it's Jackson Pittman. <laughs> Guess who? Give him the chain himself. He almost had it on third down, and he gets it on fourth down. He almost had the handoff. He did. He's not 100% by any stretch, but I'm sure he wanted to play, and he's going to come up firing and throws completes. It's Army just not the same. Third and short, they pick up the first down. Connor Slumka, maybe saying the ball came out at the end. Still unpiling bodies to make sure Navy might have it. They do. Guess. No, it's, it's Jairus Warren. I thought it was going to be picked. And that's the, the get six accomplished. Three and outs, a fourth down stop, and the last one is. Rip it out of there. The fumble. To finish off the last 240 here. Perry. Now there he's got the record. And he's carrying tacklers with him down to the 20 yard line. Second and five at the 15. Now compare a little hesitation then up to the edge. Around the corner into the end zone. Touchdown Malcolm Perry 15 yards. He's done it all today. He did it one more time. 15 yards to cap a 47 yard march. 304 rushing yards for the player of the year in the conference and the player of the day. Hopkins deep down the middle. It's intercepted. Picked up by Tyler Pistorio. And that'll put the capper on it for the midshipman. Runs underneath the route. Watch After the interception, personal foul. Intercepting team number 17 for an illegal blindside block. 15-yard penalty. Be Navy's football first down. The give inside to midfield to Nelson Smith. Well, you don't root for anyone in this game, but for the Navy seniors who've been part of the three losses to get their win and come out of there without having any win against Army, you got to feel good for the Navy seniors. Well, they got it now. The three-game Army winning streak has come to a close. And remember those two old friends I talked about that embraced before the game and put the friendship aside for about three and a half hours? There they are again. So the midshipmen are 10 and 2. Army falls to 5 and 8. And there's the captain of captains in the mix out of Norcross, Georgia. And the best running back I've ever been around gets a hug from the coach.